Which QuickBooks subscription should you use for your business? With all the different features and options, it can be difficult to decide which one to pull the trigger on. In this video, I'm breaking down all the QuickBooks Online options and why QuickBooks Online Plus happens to be my favorite. And you're gonna wanna stick around until the end because I'm also gonna tell you how you can save the most money on QuickBooks even if you are a current QuickBooks user. I'm Jamie Troll, CPA and Profit Strategist. And if you're looking for tools and resources to help get your business finances organized and profitable, well, this is the channel that you need to be watching. So please make sure to like and subscribe. So let's take a look at the different QuickBooks online options. And right now, when you go to the QuickBooks website, this is probably what you're going to see or something similar. You're going to see probably these four different subscribers levels. You're going to have simple start, essentials, plus and advanced. And you're probably going to stare at this for a long time, trying to figure out which one of these is right for you. Now they do tell you down below exactly what the features are, but it's not super descriptive. If you're really trying to figure out what is a good fit for you, what does your business really need. So if you're moving maybe from a different accounting platform over to this one, you might have a better idea of what you're going to use. But if this is the first time you've used an accounting platform like this, then you're probably just going to scratch your head and wonder where you should start. Now, there are great things about all of these. Now, if you're directly on the QuickBooks website, you might be seeing different pricing than what is being shown here. That's because these are my special negotiated rates, and these rates last for a full 12 months. Plus, you get a free trial when you use my link. So if you want to get the best prices on QuickBooks, jamietroll.com forward slash QuickBooks. Remember that whatever they're offering on the QuickBooks site is probably only for three months. That's typically what they do. Maybe it's 50% off for three months, but I'll tell you that 30% off for 12 months plus a free trial is generally going to save you quite a bit more money than what the QuickBooks offer will. So definitely check out my special offer. Okay, so let's delve into the differences here. So we're going to start with Simple Start. Who is Simple Start really right? for. To me, Simple Start is really for those who have a pretty simplistic business model. They don't need any extra bells and whistles at all. They really don't have a lot of reports that they're planning to run. They're really doing this just for tax compliance reasons. That's why you're setting up QuickBooks just to keep track of things for taxes. Maybe you are a 1099 contractor and you know this is something that you need to do, but you don't have a lot of additional things that you are planning to do with this accounting system. That's really a a great fit for something like Simple Start. It has things like receipt capture and mileage tracking, and it is a full service bookkeeping system, which is different than some of the other bookkeeping systems you might see out there, meaning it actually generates a balance sheet. It does true double entry bookkeeping. That's why I recommend QuickBooks Online versus some of the alternatives. So now when we move from Simple Start to Essentials, which is double the price, right? You're gonna get a few more features. You're going to get things like time tracking. You're going to get a couple more users that can log into the system. But if I'm being honest, I don't think it's all that different from Simple Start, especially to justify that giant jump up in cost. However, the one that I recommend and love the most is actually QuickBooks Plus. So if you don't have a super simple business model, i.e. a 1099 contractor, service provider with no employees, right? That's a great fit for Simple Start. But if you have more complexity than that, then Plus is what's gonna give you the most features, the biggest bang for your buck. Plus is what I use. Plus gives me everything that I need. And I love just the ability to get all the reporting that I need out of Plus. I can even use it for my budgeting, which is really cool. You can see budget to actuals within the system. If you have inventory, you can track inventory in the system. My favorite thing though, too, is that I can track profitability by certain parts of my business. So for example, I have multiple different classes is what they're called in QuickBooks that I use to track my profitability and I can run separate P and L's for those different classes. Same thing with locations. If you have multiple different locations and you want to track some of that income or cost separately, you can set all of that up within QuickBooks 
plus really easily using class and location tracking. And also, if you do any kind of job costing, if you're trying to keep track of the cost of a particular job, maybe you're a landscaper and you're wanting to make sure that you're capturing all the labor and materials you're using for a job so that you bill the right amount, then this is a great, great solution for that because you get job costing as well. So you can see just the difference here in the features that you get. I also love the reports that you can run. You can run pretty much any report you can think of. You can run out of QuickBooks Plus, and I'm a big fan of customized reports. So for me, that's a great thing. So personally, I just think your biggest bang for your buck, again, unless you're a very, very simple business model that doesn't need much other than maybe some invoicing capabilities, right? I recommend QuickBooks Plus. Now you may be wondering, well, what about advanced? Should we talk about advanced? Advanced is definitely advanced, right? It's probably not something that you're gonna want to DIY. There's a lot of different things in here. And advanced, I think, is really great if you're moving from maybe like QuickBooks desktop over to QuickBooks Online, Advanced is probably going to be the most similar to what you have gotten used to in QuickBooks Desktop as far as features go. It is the Mac Daddy, but the price is also going to support the fact that it is the Mac Daddy of QuickBooks Online. So if you really need some of these things, then absolutely, if you have a bigger business, if you have a really complex business, you have tons of locations, tons of things you're trying to manage, yeah, QuickBooks Advanced can absolutely do that for you. But if you are really more on the smaller size, small to micro business, but you want to have the features that QuickBooks is just so great at, then QuickBooks Online Plus is a great place to start. Now, other than the features that I just mentioned, overall, I just think QuickBooks Online Plus is the most customizable and it's the most scalable for small businesses. So it's gonna be able to do all of the things that you maybe don't even know that you need at this point in time. And it's gonna be able to grow with you as you grow your business. Now, if you're a visual learner like me, I'm gonna jump on into QuickBooks Online Plus so I can show you some of those features that it has that the other versions don't have so you can decide if it's right for you. So here's an example of a report that you can run if you use class or location tracking. So this means that you are assigning your income and your expenses to specific classes, i.e. Uh, potentially different streams of revenue that you have that you want to track profitability of separately. And then same thing for locations. If you have multiple locations and you wanna track the profitability of each of those locations, which I highly recommend. This is how you can use class tracking to do it. And this is an example of what a report could look like if you are utilizing class tracking, which is only available in QuickBooks Online Plus. So another feature that I really, really love in QuickBooks Online Plus is the ability to do project tracking. So if you need to do job costing, if you need to track your profitability by specific job or customer, then this is great for you. You'll be able to track everything separately, see all of your different profit margins by project, make sure that you are capturing everything and billing it out correctly. It is one of my favorite things to be able to see really clearly into what that's going on in your business. Now, if you followed this channel for a little while, you probably already know that I'm a giant profitability nerd, which is why I love that feature. And I also love the next feature, which is a budget to actual comparison. So if you have QuickBooks Online Plus, you can do a budget to actual, you can actually set up multiple different budgets and see where you are tracking, which I think is so, so useful when we are trying to get the most out of our accounting software. So those are all the reasons that I love QuickBooks Online Plus, And I think it very, very much justifies the price of that product. Now, if you're saying though, I really don't need all those functions, I'm I'm not going to use them. I really just want something a lot simpler for my business. Well, then I would probably look at whether you can start with Simple Start. Essentials is fine, but if you don't need an extra user or two, and if you don't need the time tracking, you're probably not gonna get a whole lot extra out of Essentials for double the price. So for me, it's either plus for all the bells and whistles, or it's Simple Start to really just par down to what you really need. Now, remember at the beginning of this video, I promised that I was gonna give you some extra tips for how to save money on QuickBooks Online? Well, that's what I'm gonna do now. So I already showed you my link. That's gonna be the best way to save on your subscription price. That's only for new users, only in the US. But whether you are a new user or you are an existing user of QuickBooks, there are some other ways that you can save money as well. And one of those major ways is to not set up QuickBooks Online payments 
or payroll on your own, even if you already have a QuickBooks Online subscription, if you want access to those things, make sure to email my team and we can give you better rates. So we'll be able to get you a better rate on the transaction fees and a better rate on payroll, but you do need to email my team. The email is down below. I also have an entire video on how to save the most money on QuickBooks Online, so make sure to check that video out next. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to press the like button and subscribe, and I will see you next time.